Valentine's Day is nearly upon us, so what better way to celebrate than with the premiere of Gwyneth Paltrow's new movie, Two Lovers? And Mrs. Chris Martin was all too happy to share her thoughts on what makes the perfect soulmate. I honestly feel that your soulmate will, like, if you find your soulmate, they keep things uh, exciting in the way that, you know, your soulmate is meant to sort of push your buttons and make you expand and, and be the best possible version of yourself. So sometimes that, you know, involves some exciting stuff. Exciting stuff, eh, Gwyneth? Let's just move on to the film, shall we? Gwyneth stars alongside Joaquin Phoenix, who maintained his mystery on the red carpet by not talking to the press. See, there he goes. Nominated twice for an Academy Award, Phoenix announced last year that he'd be retiring from acting and would concentrate instead on becoming a rapper. He's apparently built a studio in his home and he's not signed up for any more movies. And one man who was just as shocked as the rest of us to hear the news of his early departure from films was director James Gray. He didn't even call me to tell me, you know, and I found out about it. My wife called me uh, into the kitchen, it was on the computer on some website, look, Joaquin is quitting acting and he looked like, you know, Rasputin or something, and uh, it saddened me very much for selfish reasons and then, you know, he reminded me a few weeks later he said, you know, I have been acting for 30 years and if you did something for 30 years at the, at the end of that road, you might be a little tired yourself. And you might be a little tired that I've still not told you the plot. So, back to the movie. Joaquin plays a young Jewish bachelor who moves back in with his parents after suffering a bad breakup. His parents then try to set him up with a friend of the family, but his heart only flutters for the glamorous blonde who moves in next door. And guess who that is? Yes, it's Gwynny. Anyway, it seems playing a shiksa goddess, a Yiddish term that you'll know if you've seen Sex in the City, is a role that Gwyneth feels pretty at home with. I'm every Jewish man's dream. I've got blonde hair and I'm a Jew. It's perfect. They chase me at all the parties, even though I'm married. Does Chris know about this? 